Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a ginormous Sephora haul. It was just the VIB Rouge sale so I went a bit ham and now I'm gonna have to live in this box. This is what it came in. This is my new home so if you want to send me some stuff this is this will be my new address because I spend all my money on makeup and have will have nowhere to live. But Anyways, I'm just teasing. It was the VIB Rouge sale, so VIB Rouge members got 20% off. The VIB sale starts, if you're going to be watching this, it starts today on the 13th um, and then goes for a couple days as well. So if you're a VIB member, you still have a chance to get the sale. And even if you're not, these are still amazing, amazing products. So I ordered it online, so it came in this fantastic box. And yeah so if you guys want to see all of the amazing goodies i got then and just keep on watching okay we are going to start off with the thing that was like in the top of my shopping cart like i i go on for like a week before the sale and like it, you know move things in and out of my cart so this was always on it i knew i wanted this and that is the nars stephen klein one shocking moment cheek studio palette it looks like this it is so cool and every year NARS comes out with like a holiday cheek palette. This one is it right here. There it is. And inside you open it up. Hallelujah. Oh. So you open it up and this is what it looks like right here. Now the reason this caught my attention, this is the first time they've included a highlight and contour shade. Um, so for me, I was really excited because these tones will work to highlight and contour. The only thing is, this is very limiting for people that are darker skin tones than me. So it comes with um, a matte highlighting shade, a matte contouring shade. I'm wearing all of these on my cheeks today. Um, this is Laguna Bronzer, which is absolutely amazing, one of my favorite bronzers. And then I was really interested in it for this blush right here, which is Luster. Um, so that is a permanent blush, which I don't own, and I really wanted that one. This one looks incredible. Um, I probably won't wear this one. This is like a Barbie doll pink. And they have good pigmentation. Like, sometimes in blush palettes you worry, but like that's the Dolce Vita one there. So it's really nice. And this is what the contour shade looks like. I want to show you. It's really nice. It's just like a medium tone. It's got a bit of red in it. This is the contour shade, but like I said, it's still pretty light. It's more of like a natural contour. I have it on today. Um, but yeah, I am like, oh, it just is so beautiful. I just love blush palettes, and I think I'll get a lot of use out of this one. Um, and I love their setting powder and the bronzer, and I just think it's perfect. So that was the first thing I had to pick up. Okay, let's just stick with some palettes because those are the most exciting around the holidays. I picked up the Champagne Glow Becca and Jaclyn Hill palette. I have Champagne Glow already, but I absolutely love it and I always like contemplated getting a backup because it is limited edition. So I figured this would be a great way to do it. So this is the box and then it has Jaclyn Hill's picture on the back. It's so cute. And then this is what it looks like. So it's like a little gold. I love it. It's so cute. It's like hard and it's a little gold packaging. It says Becca and Jaclyn Hill. And inside these are all limited edition shades. Like just look at the beauty of this. So you have blushed copper, which Jacqueline has said is like a blush topper. I'm wearing it on the apples of my cheeks today over top of Luster. Champagne Pop, which is just stunning. And then this one's new and it's pearl, which is like a pearl white. So I actually have Champagne Pop and Pearl mix on my the tops of my cheekbones. Let me just give you some swatches here. So these are the three of them. So blushed copper, obviously, champagne pop in the middle, and pearl on the outside. And this is just an absolutely beautiful palette. Obviously, it's Becca. These are such beautiful pigmented buttery highlighters. And I just love the um, range. So it's also like good for all skin tones as well because you can find something in there that, you, that will work for you. So I love this. And, you know, Kylie Jenner was using it on her Snapchat. So must be good, right? Next, pa -rum -pa -pum. I'm like in the Christmas spirit. There are so many colorful makeup palettes coming out. Has anyone noticed that? Like so many bright, 
electric eyeshadow palette so I really wanted to get this one and it's expensive so with the sale it's good and this is the Urban Decay Vice 4 palette so let me just show you I absolutely lost my mind look at this it comes in a pouch like maybe I'll live in this pouch like this is like my iPad comes in a pouch. I had to buy it, but I put my iPad in a pouch. This is so friggin' cool. I absolutely love this. I could carry my eyeshadow palette and my iPad in one thing. Do your makeup on the go. And then inside, like this, I want to put this up somewhere because this is the coolest packaging I've ever seen. It's like raised up and it's supposed to look like an oil slick. It's just so amazing. I absolutely love the packaging and then here it is inside. <gasps> yes! This palette is slaying my life. Um, yeah, so this is it inside and it's just really, really cool. So it comes with a little brush that actually feels like a decent brush and then inside are all these awesome, awesome colors. What I love about it is it's very, um, these are like neutral brights, you know what I mean? So it's like these kind of like, these are, these are wearable purples down here. Even the greens, like they're still wearable emerald greens, olive greens. This color right here looks amazing. Um, and then there are some matte neutrals as well. So here are some of the swatches. So that's what I was trying to say. They're very jewel tone, which is so beautiful. Jewel tones always look amazing on the eyes and they're perfect for the holiday season. And like, they're not too crazy. Like these are kind of the brightest colors in the palette and look at how pigmented these are and like, oh, I could just, I just want to stare at this and there's a black and there's a brown and there's a transition shade. I think it's just so stunning and I don't have any of the Vice palettes, so I wanted to buy one in the sale. Okay, this video is going to be extremely long. I'm going to try to speed it up. Next, I got this Lancome Noel eye set and it looks like this. It's really, really cute for the holidays and the reason I got this is because this comes with a full size of the Lancome Grandiose Mascara, which is the one in the middle and it is like the whole kit is like the same price as the mascara so since I wanted to try it anyways I thought this was great this would also be an amazing gift it comes with makeup remover a liquid eyeliner full size a pencil eyeliner another little mascara mini and then the white um, Lancome mascara primer so but I really just want to try this mascara because I've heard so many good things about it so I will let you know if I like that okay this thing again the visual of this wins this is so cool. Look at this. I'm being weird today. Um, this is the Glam Glow Pout Mud Lip Treatment. And it looks like this. I should open it up. Is it too late now to say sorry? Uh, I've been missing more than your body. <laughs> Come on. Hello, sexy. Okay, look. Oh, so it comes with these two little balls. I'm not going to take the second one out. Um, but it comes with these little balls. And basically, you get a fizzy lip exfoliating treatment and a wet lip balm treatment. So I have really, really dry lips. And they're always cracking. And they're always giving me a hot time. So what's this? I'm like, oh my god. This is the fizzy lip exfoliator. They're playing me with all this packaging. Smells like peppermint, if you don't like that scent. So this is what it looks like. Mmm, smells delicious. So that's the exfoliating treatment, and then it comes with a balm treatment. Um, so yeah, I just am really interested. I'm always, always exfoliating my lips because they always get dry and flaky. So really, really excited about this, and I think it's just so cool, and I just love the packaging. Like, I want to put these little balls on my vanity, and I think that's so, so, so cool. Moving on. What else? So, what else? beauty blender I like the black one I don't know why it just doesn't show as much dirt but um, I got I repurchased it because I love it I can't live without it Boop. ooh I got this this is the new Marc Jacobs perfume and I got the rollerball and it is in the scent decadence I want to look up what the scents are okay so this is their new fragrance decadence the full size is like a little purse it's actually so cute um, but I just like to try rollerballs because I don't go through perfumes that much and I I changed my mind a lot with what I like. So this one is Plum Iris Saffron 
Bulgarian Rose, Jasmine, Vetiver, Papyrus Woods, and Liquid Amber. So it's floral yet like sweet and sensuous because it has the amber and like the vetiver. Um, I love very, very musky scents. Like um, my Tom Ford Velvet Orchid is like so musky, but it's harder to wear those like in the day and then like warm weather. It's more like wintry. Oh my God. Oh my God, I love this. It's amazing. So this one's woody and sensuous, but it's still fresh because it does have like the flowers and jasmine and rose in it. So it's a little bit more fresh, a little bit more daytime appropriate. I'm going to put it on right now. Oh my God, I love it. Woody, sensual. That's my kind of thing. Glamorous, surprising, opulent. Am I selling it for you yet? Oh, just go smell it. I really, really love it. And my favorite perfumes are like the Tom Ford, Velvet Orchid, the Elizabeth and James Nirvana Black. So like very vanilla, very amber, musky, warm. But this one's still fresh. This one's more daytime appropriate. Oh, oh, I love it. I'm all in it. So I got that. Oh, this one's so cool. Um, this is the Clinique. I'm really like on the hunt to find like my perfect mascara because I feel like right now I need like a really, really good one. And I've tried so many and none of them are doing it for me. So this is the Clinique Chubby Lash Fattening Mascara. A, wanted to try it, heard it was good. But B, it comes in bodacious black honey. And I wanted to try this because look at this. I don't know if you can see that. But it is, I'll kind of like go like this. So it is like a purple aubergine color. And I love this shade. It is an aubergine color. It's like a deep plum. And I think this would be beautiful since I have brown eyes. Just for like an everyday, it's a bit softer than black. Um, so I just think that's a really, really unique shade. And I'm really excited to try this. Just because it's like some different, you know? like some, But it's like almost black. It's like a really darkened, it's a really darkened plum. So I think it will look really, really cool during the day. Something a little different. Then I went over to Bite Beauty. I got the matte cream lip crayon. I love these. I have a couple of the colors, but I wanted to get this one and it is in cognac. Wait till you see this. Mm, my dreams are alive with the sound. Nope. We're not going to sing that. This is a stunning chocolate brown. I'm all about the brown lips these days. These smell so good. They smell like fruit. These are not that matte. I don't know, but they're very juicy and creamy. And just look at that stunning color. Oh, I couldn't resist. I had to get it. I think this is just so on trend. Like this is going to be my favorite lip color. You're probably going to see me wearing it like so much. I absolutely love this. And I also got from Bite one of their Lush Fruit lip glosses. And I got the shade Current. And it looks like this. I love these glosses. They are sticky, but they do last a long time. They smell amazing. And this is just like a really natural kind of soft plum color. So I think it's really nice for every day because I've been loving purple lips as well. So that's it right there. There's no shimmer or anything. Um, so just like a really simple everyday gloss that's kind of like a soft plum color. Yeah, okay, last but not least, my little points. I wanted to show you this in case you guys have the option to get this. This was a 500 point perk and it's a YSL one. <gasps> Schmancy smanchy. this is what it looks like here. It comes with a mascara. Again, I'm trying out mascaras. This Touche Eclat like primer, which is so cool. Um, these tint and oil lipsticks are my absolute favorites. You get a mini one of that and the YSL Black Opium Perfume, which I have a mini one of and I absolutely love it. It tastes like coffee and vanilla. So again, deep, dark, sensuous scents. So it comes with a small one of that. So try to get these. And then I also got a little sample of the new Glam Glow Flash Mud Brightening Treatment. I love Glam Glow. Obviously, I got the lip mud, um, but I wanted to try this one because I'm very, very sensitive and usually like peels or brightening masks break me out. So I got a little sample of that guy. Ding! So that is everything. Oh my gosh, so many good, good, good things. Um, I always get the more expensive stuff during the sale instead of like a ton of little things, right? Because it feels like worth it, right? Oh my god, I'm loving this perfume. I'm feeling myself. I'm f oh, oh, yes, I am shaking it tonight. Okay, anyways, so I really hope you guys like this video. Please let me know if you did. Give it a thumbs up. Do not worry about the fitness videos. I have tons of makeup videos coming for you guys. I'm just mixing it up. So thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. 
Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is my October favorites. Where has the year gone? 